to the ministry. Information and Media Minister Chushika Sanda has called on stakeholders to work with ZNBC to develop its dormant land. Speaking after touring the ZNBC Shoton and Twin Palm transmitters, the minister said the institution should not be experiencing challenges even to refurbish some of the dilapidated staff houses because it has the capacity to generate income using its land. We have details in the following report. Slowly, this land is being turned into a huge dump site by some residents. This is part of the ZNBC land at the Twin Palm Transmitters, which Information and Media Minister Chushika Sanda, Lusaka Central Member of Parliament Mulambo Haimbe, and ZNBC Management have toured. Ms. Kassanda wants stakeholders to work with the national broadcaster to add value to the dormant land in a bid to increase income generation for the corporation. And looking at the fact that um, ZNBC has got uh, sufficient uh, pieces of land uh, all over, dotted all over the country, I think it's important that we enter into PPPs and uh, that way we'll have um, Zambians come on board to partner with us as uh, ZNBC and make sure that we bring development. Lusaka Central MP Mulambo Haimbe says the land that the twin pump transmitters can be used for various business ventures. When we have a value adding uh, services put here, then we can get rid of this once and for all, for the benefit of the community and of course for the benefit of the institution as well. Because certainly it's a responsibility for all of us to get rid of this. We can do what we can, but uh, every time we remove this garbage, it's a temporal solution. And ZNBC Director General Malolela Rusambo said the institution is ready to work with interested stakeholders. Yeah, so it's mixed use, but uh, we would want to get uh, real value to make sure that once it's agreed that this is going to generate enough revenue, that's what we'll actually go for. Earlier, the Information and Media Minister toured the ZNBC short on transmitters, which also has about 125 hectares of land. Here, the area MP Sipolazo said Chilanga is full of farming activities and that he will engage those interested to use the land for agricultural purposes. I mean, like we've seen, we've been told that this uh, piece of land is 125 hectares and we've clearly seen that it's been underutilized. So maybe now with, this new, with the new government in place, we could, you know, put in place maybe measures, maybe even bring some farming activities into this place, which could also help this uh, generate income for your ministry also. We have so much of land, 125 hectares is a lot, and that land is not being utilized. I think it is about time that we got the PPP and we are calling upon Zambians who are ready to partner with us so that we can, uh, we can work together and partner. Utilization of this land, which has remained dormant for many years, can help increase income generation for the national broadcaster, hence the need for interested partners to work with the institution. Mark Zilgone, ZNBC News, Osaka. Now, unknown people have encroached on a 93-hectare horticulture farm.